first here. So this is Onyx versus Aladdin. And it's just speed, right? And this is just speed. Just the speed round. And so. they're going to be performing a head down 360 snake and interlace and a head up in face circles. So there you so, go, we've got the time on the screen. And the one to watch here is that head down 360 snake. See, the girls have to do a 360 through the centre before they complete the snake. Right. And that's pretty tricky. So that was the first part of the first page. And there they are moving into the interlace. And it looks like a bust on the interlace. And onto the head up circles. Finishing the circles, transitioning back to head down and over for the head down 360 snake. So the head They're up doing circles. That pretty good. That's in different, both in separate sides of the tunnel, the head up circles. They're doing it separate sides of the tunnel. Yeah. So it's like they swoop down, dive on their bellies, come up and then push themselves one to the left, one to the right, and move around the window. Oh, it's I a really it. powerful move. It's yeah. great fun to fly. Moving now into those head up circles. Transitioning back and into their third page for their head down 360 snake. Good job. Nice little 360s there. Oh, and we've got the time up on the screen. That's great. Two busts into their circles. Really fun, that transition into the circles. And they're out. Good job, girls. So that was 132 plus the bus, 142. 142. Okay, so. Aladdin, can they go faster than 142? We don't have that move in the four-way, Regan, the 360 snake. Really? No. It's why? Is there not enough room for it? Or? Don't think so, no. Right. <laughs> Would be fun to try, though. <laughs> do you do two-way as well, Anna? No, just four-way. Right. Yeah. Or at least at competition. Yeah. Yeah. Any, any plans to maybe have a go in competition? Yeah, yes, for this, for four-way. For two-way, for yourself. For two-way, no plans right now. I really, really enjoy the four-way. Okay, Aladdin, they're in. Here we go. Light is green, time has started. 360, not to leave each other behind. And they've cleared their first snake. Oh, with a bust. Uh, looks like a bust on the interlace as well. They pull it back for those head up in face circles. Interesting now, two busts for each two team. Two busts already. And that's two busts on the first page. They've got to keep oh, it clean now, aren't they? Yeah, I think they might oh. bust that snake again. Yeah. So it looks like they might be a little confused about how to do that move. Swooping down for those head up in face circles. That fun transition. Okay, and into their final page. That's four busts. I'm thinking the girls might be taking ninth. Here. Yeah, it looks that way, doesn't it? It does. And yeah, busted the snake again. Nice strong transition there into the head up circles. And seven busts, they're gonna transition out to finish. Oh, remember one, oh, and they had a bus for off sequence exiting as well. Wow, well that's obviously bad news for them, but the girls are gonna be over the moon. The girls will be very happy. So that puts Aladdin in 10th place and Onyx in ninth place. Well done, ladies. In the very first competition. Very, very first competition. Didn't wow. come last. <laughs> well, what a battle that was. That was hell of a battle. Okay, next up, we're going to have Dynamos Black and Fede and Gregor. And these guys, they're battling for seventh and eighth place. Right. I like the format. Yeah. It, it makes sense, doesn't it? It's, it's, yes. You don't have to be uh, too technically minded about what's going on. It's just one against the other and the places are there. I like it. I yeah. Like it. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> Whoever designed Ooh, it. Hang on. We have to be told officially by the judges. Indeed we do. So, Adam Matacola, the winner is... Yeah! <laughs> Good job, girls! Well done, Aladdin. So it is official, they've got the ninth place. It is.
I gotta remember we need to get it from the judges. Yeah, first. I know it kind of <laughs> <laughs> totally forgot that bit. It's a long day. Long day. Okay. Next up is Dynamo's Black and Fede and Gregor. So this is the home tunnel for both of these teams. Oh no, sorry, it's not. It's just the home tunnel for Gregor and Fede. Gregor and Fede, how long have they been um, playing together? This might be their first competition, yeah. actually. I've not seen them at another meet before. No. I think the Dynamos have been trained in here quite a lot over the years as well. Yeah. And I know Dan's going to be wanting to take this round. Okay, clean. Nice transition. And great into their second page. 360 snake. They are going for it. Yep. Transition to the head up circles. Nice, clean. 360 snake. This over to the interlace, which is a little different looking in the two way. Nice transition into their final part. Go on, boys. There you go. Nice clean exit. Clean Excellent. round. That was 115. 112, 112. Anna. 112.3, I think it was. That's the target to beat. Okay. So. Just watching Onyx there on off camera. Yeah, there. Ecstatic. Ladies. Congratulations, <laughs> girls. So, Gregor and Fede are going to need to fly clean. Yeah. Yeah, no mistakes allowed now. Was a good time for that round. Yeah, is it a bit more of a tricky round? It it's is a slow round, round, isn't it? Yeah. And the interlaces is the same moves we have in the four-way, but it looks very different in the four-way because we actually four of us interlacing through each other. Right. Here in the two-way, it's the two pairs are going the same yeah. way. There's a graphic on the screen of the uh, battle as it's commencing down to the third and fourth and to the first and second. Yep. It's hot up. Oh, very exciting. Very exciting. I'm excited for the final. I am too. It's going to be a good one. Here we go. Boys are in. Light is green. Time has started. Straight into that Snake 360. Nice 360 through the center there. And for the interlace, over for the excellent, nice and clean. See that swooping transition to the in-face head-up circles? Yes. Loads of fun. Okay, onto their second snake. They're gunning it. Great flyer, Fede. And into their final snake. This is going to be tight, Regan. Ooh, time to beat. 112. Transitioning down for those last head up circles. Can they do them in under 12 seconds? Oh, it's going to be awesome. They took it. Looks like. It looks like. It certainly nice does. The time doesn't lie, but we've got to get the official result from the judges and Adam Matikola. We'll get the two teams back into the tunnel. So our lovely wind girls are going to lead the gentlemen into the tunnel.
And Adam Matakola, the winner is Gregor Feli. Good job, Dynamo. This is well, solid round. Look of relief there on Fede's face. So that puts Fede and Gregor in seventh and Dynamo's Black in eighth. Interesting. And up next, this should be a good solid battle for the fifth and sixth place. It's Scratch Attack and Wind or Women. Now their speed round times have been very close all the way through the competition. So this is a big good one. Scratch Attack there. Scratch Attack, they were the Scratch team. Yeah. And they've blown us away a bit. They have. And then we've got two world champions here two with a new team. Exactly. Getting ready, full focus. Yeah, little heart from Katy. Lights are ready, judging system is set. And they're up. All right, game on. Light is green, time started. In for the first 360 snake. Nice 360 snake, nice and clean. Very well synchronized. Oh, I'm getting a bit pumped up here, Regan. <laughs> <laughs> nice and clean, second snake. Over for the interlace. Straight ahead there, swoop down for the head up in face circles. Fly in these lines, really nice, Regan. It's looking Third good. Third and final page. Interlace. Nice, tight, swooping down. Good, solid circles. Head down to exit, and boom. There we go, it's a good time. One, zero, eight. Great time. All right, so they set the pace there. One, zero, eight for they these. Did. Scratch attack. Scratch attack, we've got it all to play for. They do. It's gonna be quite impressive if they can beat that, isn't it? Yeah. That was a really great round from the girls. It was. You would, you would, you, you would fancy him now to win this, wouldn't you, after that time and that how clean it was as well. It was so clean. These guys, though, they've been flying fast. Yeah. So let's see what they got. We'll know in one minute. Into the interlace. First interlace. Okay. Not as fast the transition to their head up in face circles there. They're still clearing the line, which they don't, still clearing the circle, sorry, which they don't need to. Oh, got it. Oh. One bust, they're gonna really need to gun it to keep up that time now. Interlace. Clearing the line. A little high there. Good solid exit. So, one bus puts them at 113. We had a time of 108. Without that the bust, women. Without that bust, it would have been tight. It would have been tight. Let's hear what Mr. Matacola has to say. We're gonna get the two teams back into the tunnel after we've seen that replay. Get them side by side with a wind girl in the middle. And the judge is gonna tell us who won that battle. And the winner of the speed round, Adam Matacola is... For fifth place, the Windor <laughs> women. Domi and Cathy, happy with that. That's fantastic. And sixth place, what a great placing for a complete scratch team with no training.
Incredible. So there we go. It's still exciting stuff, Anna. It really is. To be honest, I was surprised at uh, Scratch Attack. You know, if it wouldn't have been for that bus, they would have uh, been matching the time, wouldn't they? I, I know. see what the other fractions of a second were, but 108 and something, it was very, very, very close. Very, very close. And zero training for those boys, so yeah. super impressive competition. Well, welcome back to the Red Bull studio here at Window. We are getting towards the end of the competition, really. We're getting down to the final battles in the two-way dynamic. We've got the four-way finals at 5 p.m. We've got the freestyle to finish off two more rounds of that. Interesting that, wasn't it? I've just been watching uh, the battle between Scratch Attack and the Window women, and these Scratch Attack put together at the last minute to compete in Dynamic. I think they'll um, take it forward and become a team. Well, one's from Canada and one's from Russia, so that might be a challenge. Yeah. But uh, I mean, I've really enjoyed to watch them fly, and I'm really, really impressed by their speed rounds. I mean, when I first heard that they were going to come and do a two-way Scratch team with this dive pool, I was like, wow, that's strong work. Yeah. But uh, yeah. They have done amazing, and they really fought. I think that was their first bust in the competition as well, incredible. which is incredible. That considering was the first bust in the first competition. First bust, never trained. Wow, incredible. Ooh. So we've got the finals all starting at five o'clock. We've got the big party tonight and the awards ceremony down in the Wave Club, the part of the big Ampuria Brava experience. We've got here Scanner Ampuria Brava behind us, the wind tunnel here, the Wave Club downstairs. And right now, down at the Wave Club, we've got the Red Bull people are there. The Red Bull van is there with the music, they're playing the sounds, the bar is open, you get yourself a Something to eat, get something to drink. If you're in the area watching, come and pop down. Anybody else who's here in the tunnel, if you want to go and relax a little bit and start the party atmosphere a little bit early, it's all ready for you right now. This is Window, and it's the Wing Games, and it's 2015. 16. So welcome back to the studio. I'm here with Onyx. Hannah, it was a great, dis a great display from. So good. What do you got to say, girls? Uh, Just so proud. Yeah, yeah, one of the main goals we had, because we've, we've not done very much training, but one of the main goals we had was to not come last. <laughs> and we didn't, so that's an achievement. Yes, achieved goal number one. Congratulations. How did you find the competition? Were you nervous? Uh, Yes, yeah. <laughs> really, Very really nervous. nervous. We've done, so we've been together as a team for uh, one month. And we've, we did about three and a half hours training. Um, so for this, it was, it was a really big challenge. And uh, we were nervous the whole time. And uh, Any particular moments that stood out for you during the competition? <laughs> uh, when I totally flew into Emma, that was a moment. <laughs> yeah, that was exciting. Yeah, we had, we had one speed round as well where uh, just, I just got completely brain locked and um, luckily Laura carried on flying and I managed to pick it up again, which was uh, what, what Adam told us to do. So thanks Adam. And you didn't verbal me. <laughs> when you're new to the discipline, it must be, I can imagine it must be really tricky, the memory of it, the visualization and knowing where you have to be. Yeah, and because it's quite new to us, so um, it was just, it was quite difficult. <laughs> Because I know as well, not only remembering it, what you've got to do yourself, but you've got to do that with a teammate too. I, don't, I can't imagine how, uh, how difficult that must be. Yeah, in some of our training, we've we've had some pretty impressive crashes. Especially on the outface. The <laughs> outface snakes, it's always a joy. Well, the crashes, they do come more, just so you know. <laughs> you were we saying with lighter. your team, it's you take turns of who goes to hospital. Yeah, just let it rotate <laughs> through and hope that we make it out before the competition. Are you guys going to compete again? Yes. We've got yeah. Bedford coming up in April, um, and then we'll just see after that. So. We'll be back next year, though, for sure. Congratulations, girls. That's a result. Thank you very much. Yay! Laura and Emma, Team Onyx, thank you very much. And it's back to the action. This is Window, it's January, and it's the first competition of the year. The Wind Games, and the games begin.
Me and Anna are having a good little dance there off camera. Really nice. We've still got it, eh? <laughs> Never lost it. <laughs> What's going on next then? Two dynamics really heating up. It is. Okay, now we have the semi-finals and that's going to be the real big boys coming out to play. And it's the Window Warrior Bros against Almost Vertical and Window Flash Warriors against Dynamo Red. And anything can happen here, Regan. So now we're going into speed and... We're going to do speed and then we're going to do free. And then if there's a tiebreaker, it will be for a speed round. Right. Okay? Yeah. So the first we should do is speed, and that will be for the same drawers we've just seen. Everybody else compete for their ranking of the lower half of the table. So it's the head down 360 snake. This is the one we don't have in the four way, but they do it in the two way, and really impressive. I think I really enjoyed to watch the girls fly that actually. They yeah. nailed that. They killed that. Then we have the interlace, uh, and then we have the head up in face circles, which has got that really cool transition to go head up and then go the other way. It's a lot of fun. It's good to see two-way dynamic back again. All the tunnels have different formats for the competitions, don't they? Some don't have VFS, some don't have two-way dynamic. I don't know, it's hard. Well, we've got the Child Wars in, in, um, in April. What's I'm that actually be? not sure if they've released their format yet. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll have to see. I think it's see. just dynamic though, Is isn't it? Just, it? it was last time. Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's good. It's a good show. Yeah. I had a little rumor the other day about who's going to be performing at the closing party. and. It's is it Katy Perry again? It might be. Come on, who is it? Tell me. It's going to be you. Well, tell, oh, I'm doing it anyway. <laughs> yeah. Nobody's listening. Come on, tell no, me who it is. I can't. Why? I can't. Is it male? It might be. Is it female? It, well, it's male. It's male. It can't be female. Is it a man? Unless maybe. Is it a male man? Who knows? It might be a male man. Is he a singer? Is he a magician? Is it David Blaine? It is David Blaine. <laughs> is it? How did you know? He's going to make the tunnel disappear. <gasps> That would be cool. No, but seriously, is it a singer? That would be cool if he made the tunnel disappear. Yeah. Is it a singer? Yeah, he's a singer. Is it a rapper? He is not quite a rapper, but maybe somewhere around there. Is it? Oh, I that know it is. Who? Uh, uh, is it? Ooh, ooh, Riga, no. No, I think I might know. Yeah, well, ooh. I won't say anything. Good. Right. Stop it. I can't even say a little Stop clue. It. No. Look, the Rex is talking to you. <laughs> I won't say anything, Focus. anything more about that, indeed. Okay, so that's exciting, though, isn't I it? I know. It'd be lovely. <laughs> lovely. What are you going to be doing? Are you flying? Are you going to be commentating? I'm what? actually not sure at the moment because we have to see how it fits in with our, um, our schedule for the, all the other teams. Right. But uh, we, I mean, Dummy's definitely going to be there. Amy and Sharon might be there. I really hope to be there as well. So we'll see. So I hope I've got somebody with me there. I don't want to be doing it all on my oh, own. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, the commentating. <laughs> you can't all be flying. <laughs> okay, well, we'll see. <laughs> okay, we're going so to we the action. We have to be on the side of the glass, you know. You like it, boy? Yeah. I, I do like it. Do <laughs> Five like flying, seconds though. to go until we're back to the tunnel for Ooh. these final battles. Okay, and you can see on the screen here that we are showing, they are showing us the draw for the next round. We've just gone through it, but just to let you know again, it is head down 360 snake, interlace, and head up in face circles. And up first.